Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of excitement and expectation. The Emirates Stadium, in all its glorious modernity, this symbol of new Arsenal, the Arsenal of the 21st century. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, Pierre Emerick Aubameyang, Peter. It's his pace that's his main attribute, especially over those first few yards where he just seems to glide away from defenders, gets himself into great positions and likes to hit it hard and nice and early. That's a horrible combination for any defence that's trying to deal with him, I can tell you that. Yes, he's certainly the one who carries the hopes of his team. As you can see, we've already started here. Partey. A searching ball out wide. Deflected behind for a corner kick. Walcott attempts a clearance. Chance! Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team, really, your striker should be the first line of that defence, and, and he's delivering. Ties lifting it over. Great build-up. It all deserved a better ending. The timing of the pass and run was exquisite. Romeo gets it away. Tierney. Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Arsenal with another corner. been taken short lovely bit of skill Walcott it's a fine run and he's happy to keep going it's a very good battle there terrific to watch and here's Aubameyang. Aubameyang! Walker Peters gets good distance on it. And it's Shaka. It's come loose. Both sides a bit too casual in possession. Balls loose. Who's getting there? Romeo trying to get there. Romeo out on top in a really physical duel. Forward it goes. Out to the right. Delivers a cross. Out for a throw. Ward Prowse tries to get it forward quickly. Chance to break. And it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Saka 
Saka who's pulsing down that left hand side. No change to the score. Nil nil it remains. Shaka. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Oh, he's taken out, that'll be a foul. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket, it's just a stern lecture. Granit Xhaka. Nicely controlled. Oh, that's a fine challenge. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Southampton seem happy to let their strikers roam out wide. I wouldn't want that. No? No, well, my worry is that their, their main threat is being shifted out of contention. He's put it on the right now. What's on? Great run, this. He's covered quite a distance. Not much subtlety. He's launched himself there. Sucker. And here's Aubameyang. Aubameyang really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. Well, that's where he wants it. Done very well to intervene. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. And it's a babby. Oh, tries a shot! Very well played by the skipper. He was only too aware of the importance of a goal at this late stage in the first half. He knew it would affect the teams. All part of the thought process from someone in his position. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out. Never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. So we have our breakthrough. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. And it's half time here. So there you have it, a close sport half of football. But it still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front end for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. Arsenal head for the dressing room in possession of a 1-0 lead. So we're already into the second period. Arsenal going well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Romero. Tierney. Oh, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. Granit Xhaka, Partey. I wouldn't fancy playing up front in these circumstances, to be honest. There's absolutely no supply. There's a clever pass. Played into space out wide. It's a goal kick.
Walker Peters, and it's played forward. They get a throw in. The message is clear, none shall pass. Hoists it forward. Saka. Granit Xhaka. Being still separated by the game's only goal. Saka. And here's Aubameyang. Goes for goal! Romeo gets rid without sophistication. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, it's a natural instinct to defend when ahead, but it's too early for them to settle into that practice just now. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. He spotted the run and played him through. Hits one! It's anyone's ball. Southampton claiming a corner, and the referee concurs. And that has been cleared. And here's Ward Prowse. Defenders on the back foot. Walker Peters. Has he found his man? Just brushed off the ball there. The breakthrough came in the final moments of the first period, and it's 1-0. Plenty of appeals, but the referee is not interested. Gets the better of his man. Obama Yang. Good clearance and very necessary. Tate. Obama Yang. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? And they've been given a corner. They've played it short. Goes for goal! Should have been two. He got too ahead of himself there, thinking how he could have made things safe. Walker Peters. And it's Walcott. Looks to clip it forward. Has a pop! So close to drawing level. That was extremely good focus from the keeper, and it could turn out to be quite a significant moment. <laughs> Defending of the desperate variety. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. That's great strength on the ball. That's surely a foul free kick.
knocks it away. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Oh, he's caught him there, it's a free kick. Almost there, and the players can feel it. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. Saka. Saka brings the ball forward. Cut out in the nick of time. Confirmation that there will be two minutes stoppage time. Xhaka goes looking, tries to get it clear. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Arsenal hold on. It's a narrow squeak, bit of luck, some judgment. 1-0 the score at the final whistle. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Well, Peter, I'm sure a more comfortable margin would have been preferable, but you can't expect to get your way all the time. I think it was a win earned through...